Hello students. So today I will make you understand the difference between this and that. So today we are going to do the page number 19 from your English Primer B book. And we will know when we are using this and when we will use that. And with that we will also know the difference between my and your. So let's start. Now here you can see this that it is written and this is used to tell about nearer object. Nearer means which is near to us. That is used to tell about farther object that is far away. So that is the difference between this and that. So let's we will see some example and we will know something more. So we know that this is used to tell about nearer object. Now in this picture you can see the hat. It is just near to that hand. So we will say this is a hat. So as it is near to the hand that's why we will say this is a hat. So the object which is nearer to us we will use that time this T H I S this. So we will use the word this when the object is near to us. Now here you can see that T H A T that is used to tell about father object. So when the object is far away, see here you can see the kite. It is too much far away from this hand. So it is in the sky and we are pointing out over there and we are saying that is a kite. So when the object is far away, then you have to use that. T H A T that. So look here. Here are four pictures. In the first picture, you can see a girl. This is Preeti. Preeti is a girl. Here we use the word this to talk about Preeti. That is Ginger. Ginger is a dog. Here we use that to talk about ginger. An easy tip to remember this or that is to point out. In the second picture you can see I had given some arrows. So here you can see one dinosaur is there and he is pointing out. He is pointing out to Preeti and to ginger. So when we are talking about ginger, we are using that. That is ginger. And we, when we will talk about Preeti, we will say this is Preeti. Because Preeti is near and ginger is far away. So an easy tip to remember this or that is to point out. Okay, if you will point out then we can understand which one is this or which one is that. Now in the next picture, third picture you can see here we are using this when the thing is near to us. Here you can see for a single thing, single animal, single person, single thing we are using this and when it is far away on the fourth picture you can see the boy the animal the thing when we are uh, talking about a single thing or animal or person we are using that so here the toy train is near 
So we'll say this is a toy train and the swing is far away out of the room. So we'll say that is a swing. So this is the difference between this or that. So you have to identify with the distance of the object. Okay. Now look at your book, page 90. Here, this, that and my, your. So these things you have to learn. You can see this first picture. In this first picture, this man is talking about his hat. So he is telling this is my hat. And when the man is talking about that person's thing, he is telling that is your hat. So you can see the man is pointing out with uh, to that monkey which is on the tree and he is telling to that man that see that is your hat. So like this when we are talking about our thing that means if I will talk about my things I will use this is my pen, this is my uh, eraser, this is my pencil, whatever. And when I will talking about your thing, that means if I want to see anything from you, then I will say, show me your eraser, show me your pencil. So, we are using my for myself and we are using your for yourself. So, in this way, in this page, it is given. So, you have to learn it properly. Then next is this is my car. So, he is talking about his commodity. That car is belong to him. So, that's why he is telling this is my car. And then the car is also near to him. That's why he is telling that this is my car. And when the man is talking about the next man, he is telling and the uh, car is also far away. So, he is pointing out and he is telling that is your car. So, the man is talking about now that person's car. So, that's why he is pointing out and he is telling that is your car because that car is far away. Then, this is my face. So, when I am talking about my thing, it will be near to me. Then, I will use this. This is my face. And now that girl is showing to that boy's face and she is telling that is your face. So, that boy is little far away. So, that's why she is telling that is your face. So, in this way, you have to read this page and you have to know what is the difference between this or that, my or your. Okay. So, I think I had given you some ideas like that you can understand that how to identify this or that, my or your. So students, I hope you enjoyed the class and you understood the difference between this or that, my or your. So, we will meet again on the next class. So, what you have to do? You have to read the page nicely and you have to learn the spellings. So, that's all for today. Bye-bye.